Hey y'all, welcome to another vlog. So I just finished putting up some items that I picked up earlier from Target. And I'm actually getting ready to wash my hair, you guys. I have a campaign that I'm getting ready to film. And I ran out to Target earlier to pick up the products that I'm gonna be using to film the video. So the campaign is with Mayel, y'all. I love working with Mayel. I've been working with them for a while now. And of course they make very nice, high quality natural hair products. I picked up some products from the Avocado and Kamanu, Tamanu line. And these are anti-frizz and I'm gonna do a style with heat. It is getting hotter here in Atlanta. So I definitely wanted to try these on this style that I'm getting ready to record. And so yeah, it's gonna be a blow dried style. And I'm gonna try some wine curls. I've never done that before on blow dry hair. So I'm excited to see what that turns out like. And it's just time for me to do something to my hair, y'all. But I have an actual hair appointment next week to get my grays covered cause Y'all, the grades be coming in so fast. So yeah, I have that next week. And then I also am gonna go ahead and get a silk press then. So I'm about to go ahead and set up all my equipment, y'all. And I'm trying to figure out, am I gonna break this filming up or just do one curls tonight or wake up super early in the morning and start on the one curls? I'm not really sure, I'll figure it out. But let me go ahead, y'all, and start setting up. So I am done blowing my hair out. This is what we have. So I'm just gonna go ahead and tie it in a silk scarf. Cause y'all, there's no way I'm gonna get through wine curls tonight. It is a little bit past nine o'clock, so I'm just gonna do it tomorrow. So I'm either gonna wake up super early in the morning or do it after I log out of work tomorrow. But anyway, I just turned the oven on, y'all, cause I am still eating on my pasta. And I'm so proud of me, you guys. Normally, I do not finish food all the way. Like, I don't finish my meals. Sorry, y'all, it's dark. I'm trying to get this light together so yeah normally i don't finish my meals but i'm doing really good with this one because the pasta was really good so y'all my chef skills i'm upgrading them so i'm gonna go ahead and take the pasta out and then heat some garlic bread up and then i'm gonna call it a night y'all because yeah i'm not extremely sleepy but i just need to work on going to bed sooner <laughs> Thursday. I feel like this lighting is off and I'm trying to show y'all my hair because it's looking so cute. So let me go into the bathroom. So yeah, this is what my hair came out like y'all. I ended up doing one curls and they came out so pretty y'all. I did it on blow dry hair. So we are not sure what this is gonna look like tomorrow. I probably will put some flexi rides in it to try to preserve what I can. Um, Since I worked pretty hard on these curls. I just finished up filming all the content for the campaigns. Yeah, I really love how my hair came out. Y'all have to let me know if y'all have actually tried these, but I will definitely be posting the tutorial on shorts. By the time this is up, the short will already be up. So check it out. It's like after nine o'clock now, which is pretty late. And then I don't know what I'm gonna eat for dinner. I was gonna order something, but it's getting late. So y'all need to hurry up and place my order. I had Firehouse a few weeks ago. It made me pretty sick um, the night that I ate it. And I've actually been kind of trying to avoid eating out, but I don't have any groceries right now. So I don't have a choice tonight, but to eat out. And then I may get a few things for the weekend um, tomorrow to just hold me over because I won't be here for a while next week. So I hope y'all are having a great week and I'll be checking in with y'all y'all tomorrow y'all know what i had to come back on here because i stayed up so late last night y'all going ahead and ordering my couch i'm so excited i finally pulled the trigger and i'm so ready for you to get here y'all i'm just so happy i ended up going with a neutral couch and i made sure that it was one that was like a spill resistant or stain resistant kind of couch and they say it is it has the performance fabric and i even saw a video of them spilling like some wine or something on it because you know i don't want to hate my friends if they come over here and spill something on my couch by accident and i can't clean it up i'm be real pissed or not even just my friends whoever you know comes over but yeah i am super excited definitely can't wait for that to get here it says the arrival time is going to be like mid-june but it looks like they do have one already available and ready to ship so i do think it'll be here before then but now it's good night for real we clocking out turn off the camera and I will see y'all tomorrow.
Hey y'all, happy Friday. Y'all, it is Friday night and I had just finished editing content for a campaign that has to go live this weekend. So y'all already know the hair campaign. So as y'all see, this is what my hair is looking like the next day. It didn't really last. I put some flexi rides in my hair to try to make it last. Obviously that was a fail, but I think what I'm going to do is go ahead and just do a braid and curl on this stretched hair and call it a day but y'all this has been such a long day i really clocked out of my nine to five and got straight on editing so it's after nine o'clock so yeah i'm exhausted but i ordered food again because i plan on going to visit my family tomorrow so there's really no point in me even getting groceries if i make it though y'all because at this rate i am so exhausted so y'all i actually made me a little drink over here <laughs> um i had a little bit of jack honey left so i mixed some of that with a ginger beer or a little bit of ginger beer i have not had any liquor in so long y'all because y'all know i've been serious about my water intake so yeah i've been trying to not drink a whole lot of anything else but anywho i have some laundry I need to put up so i think i'm about to go ahead do that and clean up a little bit and just head to bed and definitely try to do something with my hair so yeah let me go ahead hop in this shower and i will see y'all tomorrow <laughs> So I just got in from the store. Um, I ran out to Fresh Market, Publix, and Target. So I had a taste for hot wings earlier, y'all. And I was about to order some, but I was on the phone with my sister. And she was like, why don't you just make your own? And I saw Nora Smith make some a while ago on TikTok and said I was going to do it. I don't know what I was thinking, y'all. I was thinking the recipe may just take a whole lot. But really, I looked it up and it looks pretty simple for the most part. So I bought ingredients to make my own hot wings and also to make my own ranch. So, oh my God, y'all just thought about it. I forgot my celery. Y'all, I'm the worst. That would have been my one vegetable for this meal that I actually needed. But we're just gonna have to make do without it because I'm not going back outside, y'all. It's been quite rainy and very humid. So yeah, so I'm about to go ahead and take out everything. I ended up buying some mixing bowls. So I got some ceramic ones at Target. And I think these are so cute, y'all. So these are the ones I ended up getting and they are a really nice set of bowls and they're really heavy. So I love that, just good quality. And then I needed a wire rack to put the wings on because I didn't have this so the fat can drip off of the wings. So I bought this and I got this random pecan tart dessert from Fresh Market as well. And then these are the actual wings, y'all. So they were out of flats. So I only have drums. So I think he put 10 in here. So yeah, I'm about to go ahead and start prepping my food, clean these new dishes, and then make my wings. I had thought that I had bacon powder, but why did I just look, y'all, and it's actually cornstarch. So I'm pretty pissed right now. Thank the Lord I stay close to the store. <laughs>
happy Sunday. I just heated up some pasta that I ordered the other night, but y'all, my hot wings last night were pretty good. I do think my measurements were a little bit off and I only made seven last night because um, that's all he gave me. I thought it was gonna be eight to 10 and I'm actually not going out of town, y'all. I said I was going to my hometown, but there have been a change of plans, so I'm staying here. So I do need to go to the grocery store and get a few more things for the rest of the week. I may just need a couple of breakfast items. Oh, and also maybe some lunch items as well. And I just posted my ad for my L, so that took a while, y'all. It's so crazy, like these days it takes so long to post when back in the day it used to take like five minutes, but now it takes like two hours <laughs> creating all these links. It's a lot and it's so many more platforms now. But anyway, so I have that done, but y'all, I am currently cleaning my microwave because it looks crazy, okay? Y'all need to see, y'all don't talk about me, but things have been splattering. So I bought a lemon yesterday when I was at the store because that is my favorite way to always clean my microwave. So I pretty much cut the lemon in half and then I just squeeze it in here and I already did it with the first half. Then I'm gonna go ahead and put this in here, place this in the microwave for three minutes, I think they say. And then I'm just gonna wipe it down. That's always truly y'all the fastest, easiest way to clean your microwave. And then I like that you don't use chemicals with that cause I be using bleach and stuff. I feel like I shouldn't be using it, but sometimes I just feel like I need it to disinfect counter areas and stuff. I have a couple of packages that came, so I need to go check the mail. Um, I do kind of want to get outside. I make a walk. It's a little after two o'clock. Um, it's been taking me all day with that content so y'all this is what my clean microwave is looking like y'all this was so 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 easy to wipe out after i just put the lemon in there the door everything is just so clean so oh yeah i love that little hack but i am actually visiting chicago y'all for the first time this week so i have a feeling that i'm going to be doing a good amount of walking because i'm just so excited to explore the city so i purchased a new pair of tennis shoes that i really needed um so i need to go pick those up at the nike store but i'm gonna finish this pasta first and then make me a matcha real quick and then I'm gonna head out. Hey y'all, so I am back home and when I tell y'all it's very, very warm outside, okay? It is hot. So I just ended up having to run into the store and get my shoes for myself, but I really like them, y'all. I know I got them on the counter, but you know, I haven't worn them, so whatever. <laughs> but um, I will definitely clean it anyway. But yeah, they are just a pair of Air Max is and this is brown here and this is like a gray color so like i'm feeling them so yeah got these picked these up from target to travel with y'all i got some flowers as well from the grocery store and since i'm back in corporate i got this book y'all and it's pretty much for black women who are trying to thrive in the corporate environment because as we know it's a lot of hidden rules and things like that that we don't know as black women and just kind of black people in general so i definitely want to read this book this was actually one of my sister's clients that's how i found this my sister's a web designer so she did this author's website and she's going to let me know about the book so y'all i'm definitely going to start on this tonight and i'll have to let y'all know how that is if there are any other corporate girlies that follow me <laughs> oh yeah you want to say hey Tasha? Y'all's come see Deja in Atlanta. Yes, the beauty mm -hmm. regimen salon. Yes, where are we at? Northside Drive, right? Yes, Northside and Midtown. Yes. <laughs> she got me together, y'all. Wait till we get this bang curled. It's gonna be, <laughs> it's gonna be lit. <laughs> Hey y'all, so I made it back home and y'all, I'm loving my hair. It is so cute. So I decided to go ahead and get my bang cut because I have been contemplating cutting a curtain bang for so long. Y'all, I used to kill bangs back in the day, like middle school, high school, because I didn't wear my hair in its natural state. But the reason I was hesitating on doing it this time is because I wasn't sure if it would, you know, make my hair look crazy or too uneven when I do curly style. So Deja assured me that it should still be cute when I do wear my hair in its natural state. I mean, even though this is still natural, but obviously still pressed, but Y'all know what I mean, my uh, natural curls. So I'm gonna take like a big roller and roll it 
all the way back for tonight but really y'all my hair is not gonna be rolled too long because i gotta be up in a couple of hours for a super early flight to chicago so yeah i'm so excited it's my first time visiting chicago so i am going to be there very early in the morning and definitely gotta be at the airport extremely early i haven't even packed y'all and it's after 10 o'clock so I don't know if I'm getting any sleep at all tonight, but we're, you know, I may just pull an all-nighter, take it back to college or whatever. But um, I pretty much, for the most part, I think know what I want to wear and know how I want to dress because it's going to be pretty hot up there. But yeah, let me go ahead, jump in the shower, and then I'm going to start packing. That was 2017, all good, chuck a look around, find one to see my type, damn my dog and he know what I like, he done found me plenty in my life, problem is I meet a girl tonight, then I go and treat her too nice, gallery of credit card swipes, I don't even know if she a wife, but I do know one thing though, women they come they go, Saturday through Sunday, Monday, Monday through Sunday, yo, baby I love you. 